is an emotional day in court for the man accused of attacking his wife with a box cutter in the parking lot of a baby's R Us. He broke down in tears as he waited to go before the judge. Local tennis Michael Seiden is live in Fort Lauderdale with this bizarre court appearance. Michael. Yeah, Louie, no doubt this is really bizarre. In fact, police telling us that the suspect in this one woman are actually newlyweds, but for some reason yesterday afternoon they got into some type of dispute, and that's when this husband's accused of going on the attack. Charged with attempting to murder his own wife, George Hernandez remained silent in court Wednesday, but his emotions set it all. Having reviewed the probable cause affidavit, I find proof of guilt evidence and presumption of the defendant's guilt great. For that reason, he'll be detained without bond at this time. The judge's decision comes a day after Hernandez was hauled away in cuffs, accused of going on the attack, stabbing his wife Liliana Manette with a box cutter in the parking lot of this Babies R Us on Commercial Boulevard in Lauder Hill. Police say the domestic dispute began inside the couple's SUV, then poured out into the parking lot. Liliana tried to run from her husband while bystanders looked on. The terrifying scene playing out in front of dozens of witnesses, including several who jumped in, stopping the attack before police arrived. The witnesses did put themselves in, in harm's way. Uh, this man was yielding a box cutter at any given time. He could have turned on them. Uh, we thank them for their hero heroics. Uh, but they did put, put themselves at severe risk. When police arrived, they found Liliana covered in blood, suffering from multiple stab wounds. Tonight, she's recovering in the hospital, lucky to be alive. Yeah, and her condition is actually improving. In fact, just before airtime, a detective told me that they will go to the hospital in the morning to interview her, get her side of the story. Hopefully, we'll learn some more details about this disturbing attack. We are live tonight in Fort Lauderdale. I'm Michael Seiden local 10 news.